USC quarterback Caleb Jerome Ezekiel Williams is widely regarded as the future number one pick in the 2024 uh, NFL draft. And he's been labeled the next Mahomes, uh, transferred in from uh, Oklahoma uh, over to USC, followed Lincoln Riley, and led the men of Troy to 11-3 and record, won the Heisman. All of that stuff, all the superlatives, he is the real deal. And he is the probably the surest bet at quarterback since, I don't know, Andrew Luck. You know, and the Vikings in the 2023 NFL Draft have done their best to make this USC Vikings or USC North uh, as they they drafted Jordan Addison 23, as well as Makai Blackman, the cornerback, uh, in the third round. Of course, Addison and Caleb Williams go way back like chiropractic. Uh, since there are both uh, transfers in uh, for, uh, to USC in 2022, uh, Addison coming in from Pittsburgh, as well as Williams coming in from Oklahoma. And Makai Blackman, uh, another transfer yeah, coming in from Colorado. Uh, of course, they develop a friendship, mainly because uh, Blackman picked off Caleb Williams 17 times every single practice, give or take. I, I, I don't know. I, like, like, things happen. Things certainly happen in practice, man. And uh, Caleb Evans over on the gram uh, gave some props to the brand new Viking, Makai Blackman, uh, posting on his stories. Uh, so he, he reposted uh, a photo of Makai Blackman in his number 11 Vikings jersey. Absolutely loved to see it because, hey, I mean, we, with Kellamon and uh, Laquan Treadwell, we're used to number 11 stopping offensive drive. So may as well be on the defense side of the ball. Uh, but Caleb, uh, uh, Caleb Williams with the mm-hmm. Already loving the purple, already digging it. It's already good to go, man. And, and the Vikings make, make making a smart play because not only do they have the number one facilities, number one in the NFLPA survey, where they got the best food that players don't have to pay for, uh, they got the best treatment, they got, have the best facilities, all of that stuff. And now just plucking every single former teammate, just getting Jordan Addison, uh, Caleb Williams' number one receiver in targets, receptions, yards, and touchdowns. No big deal uh, last year, as well as Makai Blackman, a guy that he obviously likes. So we're going to make it happen. So, well, first off, Caleb Williams, he needs to do this. He needs to pull a John Elway and be like, yeah, I'm not playing whoever drafts me at one because the Vikings are obviously going to have a good season. Vikings are obviously going to be drafting at 32. And, hey, (sighs) Who sends a Super Bowl winning quarterback out to pasture? Kirk Cousins. <laughs> yeah, it's just like during the years of Brad Childress, like Childress could have won a Super Bowl in 09 and the Vikings could have fired him right after the parade and fans have been like, all right. <laughs> it's hilarious to me, man. But Caleb Williams needs to be like, hey, any teams that drafts me, I'm not going to report, report for unless it's the Vikings. Like any team that drafts me, you're either going to have to trade my rights or I'm going to re-enter the 2025 NFL draft. Exactly what he could do, man. Or... The Vikings can make a trade. All right, so the Vikings are probably coming up from 32. So for the number one overall pick, which is likely going to be Caleb Williams, four firsts because they're going to be late first-round picks anyway. Who cares? We'll include Kirk Cousins because they put a one-year Band-Aid extension on him. Daniil Hunter, uh, Cam Bynum, Cam Beasy, as well as Rudy Gobert. It's a different sport. I don't care. If he, if he gets traded to a, a city that doesn't even have an NBA team, I also do not care. Do not care uh, in the slightest. So I feel like they're going to make it happen. And by surrounding Caleb Williams already uh, with some of his former teammates, uh, I think it's pretty clear that Kwesi is playing uh, 5D underwater chess. Like he already has it planned out, and it's going to happen. It's going to happen, man. Your thoughts are thoughts. Uh, Future number one overall pick, Caleb Williams, uh, loves him some purple already. Mm Mmm. Hmm. Let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.